Trump talks about possibly using the National Guard or even the military to round up those who he considers the enemy within. I think the bigger problem are the people from within. We have some very bad people. We have some sick people, radical left lunatics. And I think they're the and and it should be very easily handled by, if necessary, by National Guard or if really necessary, by the military. When J.D. Vance was asked about it at a rally, he said that it's about violent rioters and looters. Like 2020's BLM Summer of Love that killed 25 people and destroyed countless businesses. When Trump was given the chance to clarify in a separate interview designed for women, he rambled incoherently about Marxists and communists while saying that Nancy Pelosi is part of the enemy within. Anyway, if Trump actually means what J.D. Vance said, where it's about stopping violent rioters and looters, I don't consider that to be a bad thing, honestly. Trump should have never allowed that to happen the first time. But if this enemy within is just individuals or groups that Trump finds abhorrent or he just doesn't like for whatever reason, then that's downright terrifying. That would easily be considered an authoritarian fascist move. MSNBC and CNN and many others have taken the terrifying latter interpretation. If Trump doesn't eventually state that it's about, you know, violent rioters and looters, then I may eventually share mainstream media's interpretation. I don't know, Jill Stein is starting to look better and better as time goes on when I compare her to the alternatives. Not that she has a chance of winning, but I just can't see myself supporting Trump or Kamala. Just saying.